the dredger is, is, is actually part of the infrastructure system of the port. We are responsible for maintenance of the depth in the port so that uh, bigger ships can come safely without uh, running aground. And also we are responsible for maintaining the, the depth in the channel to ensure that the channel is always clear. Whenever sand accumulates, we come and clean it out. The dredging of the sand trap is of paramount importance to the port to keep the entrance channel open and to depth and to the correct width. So that for the port, that is the most important function, is, is the navigation of ships and the, having an open functioning entrance channel. And also we're responsible for putting some sand in the beach to make sure there's enough sand all the time for, for infrastructure purposes as well. To my left here is the Reclaim, our big trailer suction hopper dredger, the Essendlana. She's responsible for picking sand up out of the sand trap for us. The sand naturally migrates up the south coast, gets trapped behind the south pier in an area we call the sand trap. And obviously with the sand being trapped on the southern side of the south pier, the beaches to the north of the entrance channel get slowly depleted of sand. So Transnet, TNPA, Port of Durban have got a corporate social responsibility to co collect the sand that's been trapped and put it on the beaches on the northern side. I'm the captain on the dredger Isandrana, which is based in Deben. The dredger is responsible for the maintenance of the port and also for the replenishment of the beach, uh, making sure there's enough sand by the beach. The dredger goes out into the sand trap, it, it fills up a dredge load in like under an hour, it can fill up the hopper with like 2,700, 3,000 cubes of sand. The dredger comes alongside. In the front of the dredger on the bow, there's a pipe pointing down. At the start of the hopper, there's a, a connection point. We've got a section of floating pipeline with a floating head. And then through a series of pipes and pumps, it pumps the sand into the hopper. The hopper is designed to be connected to the municipal sand pumping scheme that was part of their old hopper. Our hopper can take two dredger loads, so when the hopper is full and reclaiming into the municipal system, on the reclaim connection there's a Y piece with valves we can switch over from reclaiming sand or putting sand in the hopper to pumping sand directly to the beaches from the dredger. From the dredger to the beach is a cruder way of doing the sand, but it's a much more efficient, quicker way of doing the sand. But it's, it's an issue that you get a bulk load of sand on the beach at a very short period of time. So the city has to take care of the management of the sand, have payloaders there pushing the sand. Busy time, it's December. That's why you, we see we're also busy almost uh, the entire of this month and the next month we're trying to put as much sand to the beach as possible so that people can come and uh, you know the sand is there and they enjoy themselves. We're playing a very crucial role by supplying sand to the beach. Obviously Durban with the Golden Mile, the holiday seasons, Durban is internationally renowned for its beaches. So the Port of Durban plays a huge function and a huge role in the economy of, of Durban during the, the holiday seasons and just even in the off season when just the people of Durban come to the beach yeah, to maintain the, the quality of the beaches.